All right, everybody, welcome back to another mini draft care with my guy Steve, one half of the straight shoot. Uh, today, we're going to be doing something uh, interesting, something uh, very different. We're going to be doing a simp draft, man. We're going to be simps today, man. So uh, follow along with us, man. If you guys want to simp today, today is the day. Today is the perfect day to be a simp. We're doing 10, uh, 10, 10 people that we're going to pick and that we would simp for. First one for me, I cannot pass up this girl because this was like my all-time crush growing up one of the one of the all-time crushes i had i gotta take Lita off the rip if anybody knows me you know i'm picking alexa bliss first hands down all time like just you know step on me with heels i don't care since i took Lita, i definitely also gotta take uh stratus faction i gotta take the stratus because she was like Lita and trish and attitude with the aggression era my gosh at number two i'm going with cora jade she was uh she was written down she's written down yeah i, I can't pass up bailey no, I, gotta, I, gotta, I gotta take Bailey. Other part of the four horse women. I'm gonna go with Becky Lynch. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna stick with the uh the four horse women myself. I'm gonna take uh Sasha Banks or Mercedes Monet. Yeah, she she was there. She was she was in, in the in the list. She was there. There's one on the table that I think everybody is probably screaming in the comments watching this video. Uh Liv Morgan. I gotta I gotta take her for uh maybe it's too late. I don't know where your brain's going with this one. Gotta take Zelina Vega. <sighs> Ooh, I'm going to go with uh, XWWE, now current AEW. I am going with uh, Paige Zarea. That's a good one, man. That's a good one. Another one of my childhood crushes growing up, man. Uh, her entrance, one of the best entrances ever. I don't know if nobody says I'm taking Molina. Ooh, I'm going to go back to the Attitude Era. I'm going to go with one that I got to meet, uh, and it was a pleasure to meet her, uh, Tori Wilson. I think everybody had a crush on Tori Wilson, you know, Tori oh. Wilson was just a lovable. She was just the girl next door, right? It's only right, man. Everybody's sipping over her nowadays. I gotta take mommy. Me, Rhea Ripley. Ooh, yeah. That one, that one hurts. That was definitely, she was definitely on my list. I'm gonna go back over to AEW, and I'm taking a uh, current House of Black uh, member, Julia Hart. That's a good one. That's a really good one. It's only right that I take her. I think everybody was into her crazy ass psycho character that she had. I gotta take AJ Lee. Ooh, I didn't think it was gonna be AJ. I thought you were gonna go with Mickey James the way you said crazy. But... Uh, Mickey James was crazy too, but AJ Lee was was different. Oh, than crazy. Yeah, definite crazy. It reminds me of a lot of my exes. I'm staying over in uh, AEW, and I'm gonna go with uh, Anna J. That was my next pick, dude. Was oh, it? God. Yes. That was the one AEW pick that I want. That was gonna be my next pick. Currently was in New Japan, but heard that she's coming back to WWE soon. Give me Kyrie Sane. Ooh, very good pick. I'm going with one that not a lot of people know about. She's new and early in NXT, but her Instagram is just something different. I'm going with Stevie Turner. When you guys look that up, Stevie Turner is Turner, man. I think at some point everybody was sipping for her at one point, even though she was the boss's daughter. Stephanie McMahon is on the list, man. <laughs> Dude, she was definitely on, on my list in my last two picks. For my final pick, I'm sticking with NXT because I think there's a great crop in NXT. I'm going with Gigi Dolan. Ah, oh, that's a really good one, too. I don't want it. Yeah. 